vlog in the middle of the day with a harsh light? Probably is. Will I learn? Probably not. What's going on, guys? Hope everyone is well. I was not going to do a vlog today, but I was helping my man Kobe out with his video project. He wanted to. He wanted a little little video from me about uh, what art means to me, and uh, it's kind of an interesting question. But I think I answered it well. We'll see. So he's gonna drop a vid, I think, in March. He's doing a, a collab with some other people about what art means. And I think that's pretty interesting, doing collabs. I'm all about collabs, because more people in a video, I think, just makes it more dynamic. So I just finished making the, the, the video for him, and I just figured I'd do a quick little vlog myself, because uh, I just feel like it. Also, uh, it's basically like a sheet of ice. The snow has melted into like a sheet of ice, so if I fall on this vlog, you don't hear from me. Oh, this is really. Oh my god. Call the cops or call the ambulance or whoever you call when you fall and slip. Or if I decide to uh, upload this vlog, you're welcome. I don't even know if I can even shoot anything because, like, this light's really harsh and, like, the snow's melting, so it's not even really nice to take like a winter pick. Like, it's just, I don't know, one of those days where it's just, like, too nice outside. Sometimes too nice doesn't make for a good photo. It's kind of like my philosophy at times. Uh, side note with the microphone, I'm using the old microphone. I have ordered it. It's supposed to come on Monday. And I might do a vlog on Sunday, so I'm just gonna have to monitor how this mic goes because uh, audio, is, audio is important in a vlog. I mean, if I can say one thing about making vlogs, Make sure people can hear you. So I just finished editing the abandoned uh, vid with Brian and Andre. So, the girl? Yeah. yeah. What's that about? Really, really like that vid. I'm really glad my microphone worked there because that would have really sucked. So I just finished editing that. I uploaded it and did this Kobe thing. And I figured why not just do a vlog because I was kind of in the mood. Whenever I finish a video and upload, I always want to make like another one. So it just gives me, gives me like a reason to do it, I guess. Whether I upload this thing or not, it's a whole different story. Let's just see how much this thing makes sense. But it could be like an update, um, stuff, projects, whatever. Whatever the case is in this crazy world. Also, puddle. Not really a nice reflection here, but... Um, hopefully spring is on its way. Spring is on its way. Hopefully the vaccines are on its way and we can get back to, you know, normal. Sure. It's a convenient little seat right here, isn't it? Quite a convenient seat. Um, since Halton has opened up, I've started to message uh, the, Oakville the Oakville businesses again for those videos I want to do, those mini interviews I want to do. Um, so I messaged them and I messaged some new ones, so we'll see what happens with that. But I'd like to get a couple more just to kind of keep the momentum of the project. So that's going on and also um, Kind of working on the other big kind of collab project for YouTube that has moved on uh, with next steps and there is progress. So I'm happy to report that uh, there is progress and most likely the the project is going to be going to be made, which is which is very exciting because seeing your ideas happen, especially when you involve like other people, I think uh, I think that's pretty cool. What do you guys think? I gotta say, it is, it is rather peaceful. There's no one around. It's just nice to hear the water flowing. You hear that? It's nice, really peaceful. It's good to get outside, get some fresh air, a little bit of solitude. It does wonders for the mind, wonders for the mind, especially these days. So, I mean, this is like the ultimate documentation. I know I spoke about like the documentation theme in the other video, which kind of like made quarter sense. But when you're really just kind of like airing your thoughts, it's really like documentation. So, you know, hopefully, uh, hopefully we can document in real life soon. Toronto's supposed to open up. Well, not open up, but go down a zone or whatever it is. March 9th. So, you know, maybe maybe we can see people then. The small thing, the small things that really matter. I think we've all come to like really realize that over the past years, like the small things. So. I'm sure I'm not the only person. I love this this spot, this little kind of like little like I don't know valley, whatever you call it. But I'm going to take a pic with my phone. Don't tell anyone. Speaking of phone pics, open cheddar. Shameless plug.
-hmm. I had to rebuild my PC last night. So oh, no. still in the process of setting up everything once more. Uh, but thank you guys for joining us on Open Shutter. My name is Evans. Right, it's with Evans, Brian Salorm, Brian McGowan, Kobe. We do it Wednesday, 7.30. Yesterday, we did an episode on, if you can tell the difference between a phone pick and a camera pick. And some of them were, like, were really tough as I slide down this hill. Some of them were really tough to guess. And, you know, the theme of the show was, of course, we all love gear, but also you understand the gear that you have. Even just a phone, because it's really all about composition and how you frame up a shot. And sometimes you get some really cool pics with a phone. So uh, it was a fun show. Hopefully we can do it again. Um, a couple things, we, a couple things we have to clean up, including the aspect ratio, so it doesn't give away the file. But it was fun. So uh, tune in Wednesdays, 7:30, because uh, why not plug the show? And also follow us on Instagram, Open Shutter YouTube. I'm the hype man. Just call me the hype man. We just went around the other side of the little valley. We so it's where I took the over there. It's where I took the phone pick. And I'm just on the other side. I'm actually rereading. Atomic Habits, because I think you need to read it more than once to understand the gist, and yeah, rereading that, trying to apply it to my daily life. Um, you know, I think life is short, and you need to kind of try to do what you want to do in life. Um, you know, and at least, you know, as long as you're putting the effort in, and you're trying, and you're trying your best, it's all that really matters, and you're not worrying about what other people think. Um, I don't know, the days are flying by, like it's already March 1st on Monday, so. I can't believe it's already March 1st, so I mean this year's flying by and uh, hopefully you're on the path to uh, what you want to do this year because, uh, you know, it's important. It's important to do what you want to do because I think we put li limitations on ourselves. I speak from personal experience, but I think we st we put some lim limitation on ourselves, you know, just, you know, due to family and friends and society in general, so you gotta try because, you know, if you're not trying then you're not going to achieve, so Please try, guys. Try. That's my that's my motivational tip of the day. Brought to you by me. Hashtag you're welcome. I might call this video because uh, it's I'm spending more time paying paying attention to the ice than it, than I am to the camera. And uh, I always want to give you guys my full attention, so I just might call this video. Uh, probably didn't make much sense, but sometimes you just want to make something because you want to make something, regardless of how it turns out. The reason why I came out is for Kobe's project. So hopefully, Kobe, this worked for your project. I look forward to the final video and uh yeah thanks again for watching please subscribe for more of this craziness and we'll see you in the next video whatever that's going to be peace solid ground solid ground is key first person i saw so far big dog too he thought like i said i didn't want to i didn't, didn't want to make a well i didn't want to i just didn't feel like making a vlog but I'm here and I got the camera out, so why not?